Oh hey, I'm just working on my jujitsu. Today is vlog day 399. Yeah. Ah! Fell down and hit me in the face in the middle of the night, so that was a lot of fun. I took the opportunity to finish the bottom corners, though. Didn't do the best job of it, but... Goal board's back up. Anyways, today is Sunday for you, Saturday for me, which means I'm going to try and do a Reflections vlog. I was traveling last weekend, so we didn't do it. Whether or not we do these every week is still up for debate. But my friend Rebecca helped me refine my questions. So let's get started on the reflecting. Question one, what did I accomplish this week? The answer is yes. The main thing I wanted to accomplish this week was actually to make an editorial calendar, like to get everything organized and prioritized, and that was good. Because without that, I'm not gonna really even know if I'm accomplishing what I'm setting out to accomplish every week. But this gives me a good framework for which to start every week, sit down, reevaluate what I'm up to, what my goals are for the week, and then move forward. It also means that the content you guys get out of me should be significantly more consistent. And I'm gonna make a little bit of a web page, either, uh, like either a page on my website or a blog post that'll explain the basic gist of how that uh, editorial calendar is gonna look like. It also brings up the follow-up question, what's up for next week? The main thing I suppose would be to actually stick to the editorial calendar and do what it is that I've written down. To see how this goes, I gotta get into the discipline of really checking it regularly. The other thing is I wanna keep on top of Archivos, which we'll talk about more soon. I'm doing a pretty good job of that so far, which is really good. And one of the big things I really need to finish, like ASAP, is that application for the social security thing for artists. I need to get that sent in Monday, but just struggling with a couple of the fields on the application form. One of the things I'm not doing as well as I really want to be doing right now is exercising. I haven't been getting out and running, but if you didn't notice, this week was a little bit additionally stressful, which leads us to our next question of, did I enjoy vlogging this week? And the answer is, mostly. I had a few days where I did not enjoy the edit at all. And obviously, with titles like Scatterbrained and Getting Back to It or whatever that was, like, I wasn't doing the best. I'm really stressed out about a number of things right now. Uh, it's really feeding into how I'm producing here, and so I don't enjoy that so much. It also means that because like in doing the editorial calendar and kind of prioritizing my life, through that it's weird, you're, you're, you're like organizing your editorial calendar for your vlog, but it's so conflated with your life that, you know, they're kind of one and the same, not entirely, but enough to help me look at it and realize, okay, I have a lot on my plate right now. I need to prioritize a couple things and then let the rest come after. So part of moving forward, as well as affecting whether or not I enjoyed vlogging this week, is that I really wanna focus on making sure that I'm established here in France, that I'm actually making enough money to survive, that things are going well there, as well as I really need to finish revising Agnar's box. Those are kind of my two top priorities. Thankfully, I'm active with the tour guiding, so I don't have to worry too much about falling completely out of exercise. I'll keep running when I have the time and the urge to do it, but I'm also gonna try and let off and give myself a little bit of grace at that, because it's just, I've got a lot got a lot going on. Although granted, the running actually does help with the stress, so I wanna make sure that I keep doing that. I don't wanna drop it completely. Just trying to give myself a little bit, like I said, a little bit of grace, not be so hard on myself. Oh crap, what's question number three? I need to look that up. I'm gonna go get food. I've been sitting working for a bit. I just picked up a tour for the afternoon, which is nice. Thank you, Rachel. So I'll be working this afternoon, but I need to go and get some food first. And look at this happy family. How's it going? Your hands look very full. Yeah, Gustav! <laughs> Anyways, question three. Yeah, yeah. Question three has to do with how the getting established in France thing is going. Uh, we kind of covered that. I need to get this paperwork in for this random association that I didn't know I needed to join. Get that in and hopefully it goes quickly enough. I have a month to go before I go into the prefecture. That's the third week of September and it is coming 
very, very quickly. I know that's not talking about it, it's stressing me out. That's, that's basically the, the action point for this week is to get that paperwork done. <laughs> Next question, what did I write this week? I actually did break into Agnar's box a little bit, which was good, and I need to dig deeper into that still. I'm working on revising Agnar's box. That's the number one thing, I really gotta get into it. I also have started drafting my newsletter. I'm gonna start, I also have started drafting my newsletter again. I need to get back into my newsletter. So if you guys are interested in the technical side of vlogging, if you're interested in the stats, behind the scenes, my thoughts, strategy, kind of that that side of things, like what I'm thinking about where we're going, a little bit more about that kind of stuff. The newsletter is going to be the place to go. So I have been writing there. I've been working on drafting an email and kind of laying that out and that counts as writing. But basically the idea is that the vlog is where you can go to stick with me personally and get entertained. Patreon is where you can go to interact with me more directly and influence the vlog. And then the newsletter is where you can go to get an idea of what I'm thinking behind the scenes, see stats on that and kind of see what I'm thinking and why I'm doing what I'm doing. Also the Clark dog situation looks like it's going to be a wait. <laughs> then how do I improve the vlog this week is another one. How could I have done better last week? On the doing better last week, that was more of a personal thing. Like I, like I said, I was really stressed out and my edit suffered for it on one or two occasions, as well as the content a little bit. How I can improve it. I got the editorial calendar part done. Now I need to stick to it. Question six. How was my social life? How did I sleep and did I call my mom? We already talked to sleep. Definitely didn't do well enough on that, but I'm catching up. I'm, I'm actually starting to do a little bit better. Uh, social life, yeah, it's all right. I saw some people, which was good. Uh, it could be a little bit better, but it was nice to see some people. And did I call my mom? Yes. Did she answer? No, she never does. I'm gonna keep trying though. The secret to that is to call my dad and then talk to my mom through my dad, because she's just ignores her phone all the time. It don't even know why she has one sometimes. <laughs> Oops, skipped one. Yeah, that was actually question eight, whether or not I called my mom. And we already talked about the exercise side of things. Taking a break, pulling back just a little bit. All right, moving on. All right, time to do a tour and then, yep, that's it. Just gonna do a tour. I forget what the seventh question is, something. But I think overall I'm feeling pretty good. This was a little bit of a, it was a good week leading into this week. Going to Helsinki was great. And then this week's been all right. Next week will be better. Slow camera. Also, I don't remember what the seventh question is still. We might just have to skip it. Tour is good. The weather is ridiculous. These clouds are incredible. And I wish I was taking time lapses. But just little sprinkles here and there. That's enough about the weather. Back to the riding the bike thing. I like it. How are you feeling? Yeah, you can do it. Somebody stole one of our bikes, so uh, they're gonna double up for a second and then we'll continue on from there. Makes for quite the unfortunate detour on the day. All right, well, we managed to make it back to Hotel de Ville uh, to grab another bike. They did great, by the way, riding tandem on a one-person bike. That was impressive. But uh, having a bike stolen adds another heap of stress to the day that Great, now I get to buy a bike. I've always wanted to buy a bike. That'll be my favorite purchase ever. I'm gonna go to the right here. <sighs> so to recap, uh, we stopped for our snack. We ate. Sometime during there when I wasn't paying attention, somebody came along and stole a bike. And then we found out after, like when we were getting on the bikes to go. So uh, yeah, it's my fault. Normally I sit facing the bikes while eating. This time I didn't, because I thought I could keep a good enough eye. I was wrong. Ugh, the joys. There's of course, I remembered what it was. Is, is there anything particularly big, like any big announcements that happened today or anything particularly embarrassing that I did today? Uh, this counts. There's nothing really big that happened this week, but as far as anything uh, embarrassing that happened this week, yeah, this definitely qualifies. Great group. Really good troopers considering the hiccup there. Anyways, that was a terrible end of the day. I think that will be the end of the vlog for today. Yep, that'll do it. <laughs>